hello everyone welcome to today's class so we have started a new series that uh, interview topic simplified as all of you know right now there are a lot of interviews are getting scheduled so you are getting some interviews call i believe and uh, in the interview you are getting different type of question those questions we have already discussed uh, like in the interview sessions we have already discussed but uh, as there is no uh, like uh, simple answers to that so I try to create some um, let's say documentation where we can discuss on the different topics that are being questioned in the interview session that might be asked in the interview session so we will be discussing on those topic so let's get on to the first topic so first topic you might get in an interview that uh, a question you might get that is a what is the client and company code what is the difference between client and company code or might be what is a client and what is a company code might be you are getting such type of questions so how you can answer that so basically if we see what is the difference between client and company code so basically client is a independent entity that will represent a separate business unit okay and inside that uh, client you will be having different settings let's say some uh, set of master data you will be having some transactional data you will be having some customization settings you will be having like uh, one client will be having the data of its own okay so you will be not seeing one uh, like one client data inside uh, let's say in other clients you will be not able to see those kind of data so client are specific to the let's say customizing and master data transactional data all of this will be inside the client only okay so clients are basically let's say um, you can uh, say you can have a let's say your business unit is having let's say multiple regions or multiple locations are there so to handle let's say different locations let's say you are having some um, let's say a pack region is there APAC region means uh, Asia Pacific region and uh, you will be having EMEA region EMEA means uh, uh, that is uh, Europe and uh, Middle East we call it uh, EMEA region and uh, uh, let's say America region so you will be having different different uh, regions are there so let's say you are having let's say you can distinguish between two clients let's say you can have one client let's say for APAC region you can have a client and for EMEA region you might have a different client so that will be again that will be dependent on your client scenario how they need to set their clients how they can use their client let's say inside one server they can have uh, let's say if we take an example let's say in one system or in a let's say in a development system you can have one client for the customization and one client for the unit testing you might have these kind of classifications over there so in the development system or in the uh, uh, configuration system or in the customization system a system there you have to customize all of the things then you need to move that settings to the unit testing client there you have to test it okay so likewise you can distinguish between the clients okay that is all about client so what is a company code so company code is basically it is a legal entity where you can do all of the let's say accounting entries and the GL accounts will be there and the uh, chart of accounts will be there so all of the accounting related entries will be there so whenever you are creating a company code or you whenever you are copying a company code there you might get like some pop-ups will be arising there and you can see like uh, do you want to copy the GL account do you want to copy the chart of accounts so those kinds of settings you will be getting while you are creating a company code so basically company code is a legal entity where you can do all the financial transaction all the reportings specific to the business unit let's say in a business unit if you want to do some uh, let's say audits or you need to do some financial transactions all of this financial activity will be responsible inside that company code only okay so basically the chart of accounts the fiscal year and the fi financial parameters like controlling and other things they those kind those kind of things will be related to your company code only 
okay so basically this is the difference between client and company code so if anyone is asking you what is the difference between client and company code then you can mention all of this point or if we simplify this so you can say clients are used to manage different organizational unit within the enterprise company code are used to manage the financial transaction and reporting for specific legal entities you can answer likewise so this document i will be sharing on the uh, let's say i'll be sharing it uh, on um, our uh, whatsapp group and uh, i'll be sharing it on the tele um, linkedin i will be sharing this one so you might get this document from the linkedin or from the whatsapp group you can find it so uh, you can if you are not still not joined the whatsapp group then you can join from the link link is available inside the description now save this document or you can get this document from there or else if you don't need this document directly note it down you can note, note down this document and you can make a note of yourself so that it will be helpful for you or still if you need to have this document then definitely you can get it from either from whatsapp or from the linkedin okay so that's it for today. Let's meet again on tomorrow.